the Armoured Personnel Carrier APC, still maintains a focal point of any land service the world over. The STREIT Group Spartan, developed by STREIT Group of Canada, is one such entry, built atop a formula based on modern battlefield concepts. The vehicle has seen modest exposure around the globe, counting uses in Argentina, National Police, Bangladesh, Border Guard, Libya, Capital Security, Kurdistan, Nigeria, Oman, Police, Tunisia, National Guard and Police, and Ukraine, National Guard and Army. For Ukraine, it has seen combat service in the country's ongoing war with Russia, the war in Donbass, indeed, the vehicle is produced, under license, through Ukraine's KRAZ concern. It has also been fielded during the Iraqi Civil War, 2014 to 2017. The vehicle sits atop a reinforced suspension system, the chassis borne from the Ford F550 heavy-duty pickup truck, with oversized road wheels and excellent ground clearance. Dimensions include a running length of 6 meters with a width of 2 for meters and a height of 2.3 meters. A typical operating crew is 2 including the driver, who sits at front left. An additional 6 passengers can be housed. Over the roof of the hull can be fitted an optional armed turret emplacement which can field variable armament including machine guns, grenade launchers, and compact missiles. Beyond this is an optional unmanned remote weapon station, RWS, controlled by operators within the vehicle. Internally, the vehicle is powered by a Ford the 586.7L Scorpion turbo diesel unit housed in the bow. This system offers 300 to 400 horsepower at 2, 800 rpm and can drive the truck to road speeds of 68 miles per hour. Range is limited to the 68 US gallon fuel store. The engine is mated to an automatic, electronically controlled transmission system and four-wheel drive is standard. Armor protection is against small arms fire and artillery spray through the welded steel body construction. Bullet-resistant windows and firing ports also protect the vehicle from direct infantry assaults. Wheels are of a run-flat design. An unmanned version of this truck was showcased at Arms and Security 2016 in Kiev.